What's up out there in social media land? Hey, quick question I received via email today is, how do you get past a gatekeeper? And the answer is, well, you don't in most cases because the, the gatekeeper's whole job is to keep you from getting in. That's their job. They're called a gatekeeper for a reason. In all cases, I suggest you start with a relationship. If you can't build a relationship with your prospect, think about your gatekeeper as a referral partner. The referral partner is someone who is going to refer you in because you have shown value to them, to their customer. And in a gatekeeper's world, their boss, their, the person they're guarding is the customer. So you've got to convince the gatekeeper that you care enough about their role and the person behind the gatekeeper's role to earn the privilege to get in to see that person, which means do all those normal sales things you would do. Research well, plan well, rehearse, and then go attack the relationship of the gatekeeper in the same way you would the person you're trying to reach. Because if you don't convince the gatekeeper, you're not even gonna get a chance to, to work with the decision maker. So focus on the relationship at hand and work on that, build the relationship, do it with integrity. And then if you get and earn the right or privilege to get to the gate person beyond the gatekeeper, then, then you'll gain access. But there's no slick way around this. And if you're slick, you'll be known for being slick and you don't want to have that reputation. Here's your 30 seconds for better selling. Have a great day.